I have a sneak peek at the future of a technology in medicine that we are trying to bring to market to both treat and prevent some of the biggest chronic diseases on the planet. Uh, our company is called Intarsia. I'm going to focus a little bit on HIV. We actually have raised about $1.7 billion to date. We've been working on what I'm going to show you right now for about 10 years. And we have a product, our first product is the first once or twice a year treatment for the treatment of type 2 diabetes that's filed with the FDA right now. So when you're filed with the FDA, you don't really talk about those products. So I'm not going to talk a lot about that. But I'll talk about uh, what we're doing with Bill Gates, the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, to develop the first once a year prevention uh, therapy for, for HIV, which is something really important for millions and millions of kids, particularly in Sub-Saharan Africa. They've done so well with treatment that they reduce the transmission from mothers to babies so much that they now have the largest youth population in Sub-Saharan Africa ever. And Bill came to me last June and said, Kurt, you've got some really cool technology. I want to understand it more. We've been looking for a couple years at a way to try and develop a once a year prevention treatment for HIV. Do you think you could do that? And after a lot of discussions back and forth, we figured out that we probably could do that. And in December last year, right at the end of the year, he made a $140 million initial investment in the company, but he will fund this all the way through uh, completely for this uh, therapy we're, we're looking to bring to market for HIV. So I'm going to tell you really three things today and do a quick demo. Uh, what's the problem we're trying to solve? Chronic diseases is our focus. Um, pills and injections tend to work pretty well for short-term acute conditions, but they don't work well at all for chronic diseases. And the major reason, no matter what chronic disease you're talking about, including things like diabetes, over a 12-month period, 60 to 80% of people stop taking their medicine at some point in time. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is what causes healthcare costs and morbidity and mortality and all these bad things to happen. Two days ago, an article came out in The Lancet for type 2 diabetes, the global cost of managing type 2 diabetes in 2015 in the world was $1.3 trillion just in one year. A large, large part of that is because people aren't controlled and compliant on their medicines. Um, estimates right now are that 70 to 80 percent of people stop taking their pills and injections during the year. You can imagine if people don't take their pill or injection for the treatment of a disease, just how hard it is to get people to try and take a pill or injection to prevent a disease. And that's why Bill came to me and said, how do we take your technology to do a once a year prevention therapy? Because with HIV, you can't afford to have a day where you're not treated. If you're exposed to HIV, you're going to get it. Um, that's why our technology is so important. So um, that's the unmet need that we're trying to solve. Here's how we do it. I got to leave myself a minute to do a procedure. I've got two left. <laughs> um, we have two technologies that we combine with medicine. The first one our chemists invented they invented a way to keep medicines, proteins, peptides, antibody fragments stable at body temperatures for over three years. That's incredible because most of these medicines break down in a period of a couple hours. They can take a medicine that would break down at room temperature in two hours, put it in the same thing our chemists invented and keep it stable at 104 degrees for three and a half years. That's the enabling secret sauce of our company. The second one I hold right here in my hand. This is a little tiny osmotic mini pump that when you place it right under the skin, and I'm going to show you in a 30-second procedure, delivers a precise amount, micrograms of medicine every day for a full year. So we make three-month pumps, six-month pumps, and 12-month pumps. So three things in our products, the stability technology, the delivery technology, and then the medicine, whether it's for diabetes, whether it's for HIV. We're working on obesity. We're working on autoimmune disorders. We're going after the biggest problems on the planet to introduce a totally new way to deliver medicine. We do it in five simple steps, and I've got 55 seconds left. You clean the area so it, you, there's no risk of infection. You numb it so the patient can't feel anything. You barely nick the skin. You place it right under the skin, and you put a stereo strip and a bandage, and you're done. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to clean it. I'm going to place it right here. I'm going to numb the track so the patient doesn't feel anything. I'm going to barely nick the skin right here. You just barely nick it, four millimeters wide, that's it. You're numb, you're not feeling that. I take my mini pump, I put it in my tool right here, which is to place it. I get my spot where I want to place it. I simply put it right under the skin. In about five seconds, I pull back, and voila, I just put a mini pump right under your skin. I put a stereo strip and a Band-Aid right there, and you've got your once-a-year treatment 
hopefully a prevention therapy that we're working on for HIV or the other diseases I talked about. You come back a year later, you're asking, okay, Kurt, well, you put it in, how do you get it out? I simply put this here, I numb the area and clean it again. I'm just gonna barely nick the tip of the skin on this device after it's numbed. I just barely nick it right there, and boom, took me five seconds to get it out. I take it out, I load a new one in the device, I put it right back in the same spot, and you're treated for another year. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed your sneak to the new way to treat chronic diseases and prevent them one day. Thank you very much.